Dispatchers in Warren County have received thousands of silent or hang up 911 calls from Kings Island this year. Thanks for being here at seven with us. I'm Evan Millward. Our Madeline Oddly joins us now. So Madeline, you've been looking into this. We talked about the new phones, but these are not nearly all from the new iPhones. Yeah, exactly, Evan. We have told you about that new iPhone crash detection feature that's triggered about a dozen of those calls on Kings Island roller coasters just over the past few weeks. But accidental 911 calls from riders are really nothing new. It is something that dispatchers say they've been dealing with for years. Warren County 911, what's the address of the emergency? The call starts like this. The owner of this iPhone was in a severe car crash and is not responding to their phone. A robotic warning on repeat, followed by this. <laughs> or this. <laughs> But this isn't a real emergency. It's a roller coaster ride at Kings Island. We had six calls just over the weekend, and then prior to that, since it went live with the new iPhone, there were six others. Triggered by a feature on new iPhones and Apple Watches, meant to detect a car crash. Not sending resources is not an option. Not here in Warren County. While the feature is new, accidental 911 calls from Kings Island are not. It happened to Anna Albee a few weeks ago. It sent out an emergency uh, notification to all the people I had as emergency contacts, and it sent a note to 911. She thinks the ride might have triggered her emergency call feature. I was actually really quite shaken by it because I just felt so bad. Warren County's had more than 4,000 silent or hang up calls from the park this year. They set up a new text system to help those callers call officers off, but the feature isn't really meant for calls triggered by crash detection. We make up a call for a crash with unknown injuries because we haven't spoken to anyone. And then once that call's made up, it gets sent to it gets dispatched out to the police officer. One expert says these kinds of bugs aren't uncommon. It's doing its job to announce that uh, it found the thing it was set to find. It's just that this can often be a, a false positive. One simple fix, just turn your phone off before hopping on the ride or disable the crash detection feature, but that would turn it off during real emergencies too. I think that avid roller coaster enthusiasts for the time being might consider turning something like this uh, off, but, but I, I would not say that the average person needs to worry in that situation. Now, the good news in all this, Krupsinski says this technology really shows that it's working. She is confident, however, that Apple is going to try to address the bug soon. Evan? Madeline, thank you.